Hey guys, how you going? Hope you're all doing very well. This afternoon I'm going to be doing an update video. Now my good friend Magnus sent me a package and he's got quite a few movies in here so I thought I'd do a shout out video and I'll also show you the movies that I got. So if you haven't subscribed to Magnus, please do yourself a favour and subscribe. He is my best friend here on YouTube. He's very generous and he has a lot of knowledge when it comes to foreign cinema, especially Scandinavian. So if you're a fan of foreign stuff and you like the stuff that I have to offer, well chances are you're going to really like this guy's uh, material because I actually get a lot of recommendations from him and his taste is really good so as I said he's a good friend and hopefully he can get a lot more subscribers because he deserves them because as I said very knowledge, um, knowledgeable on what uh, is big in the foreign cinema world so if you want something a little bit different please drop down and subscribe to this guy I would really appreciate it so I'm going to get we'll get to the movies there's quite a few I don't want to make this too long we're going to start off with the DVDRs uh, the first one is Zlow or Evil now, these don't come in a case, they're just discs, so they're not really that, um, you know, interesting. But I've heard a little bit about that one, I'm really keen to see what it's like. Uh, and for, if I mispronounce some of these foreign names, uh, bear with me, you know, I'm not uh, terribly skilled at pronouncing these foreign names. Like a lot of these movies are Scandinavian releases, so obviously I'm going to struggle, but bear with me. So, the next one is Zero Kelvin which I have no idea what this is going to be about, so, um, you know, that can be a good thing. And then Reykjavik Rotterdam, which is supposed to be an Icelandic sort of gangster film, so really looking forward to that one. So we're going to start off now with the proper DVDs, and as I said, there's quite a few of them. So to start off, we're going to have Kitchen Stories. This is a Norwegian film. I really like this director. He made another movie called uh, O Horton, which I reviewed. I actually thought that was brilliant, so I hear that Kitchen Stories is just as good. A Norwegian with English subtitles. This one is an, a, a New Zealand film called Out of the Blue. It's about a massacre that took place in New Zealand, so it's supposed to be very harrowing. I've heard a little bit about it, but not too much, so I've got big expectations for that one. And of course, I'm going to be reviewing these films. This one is called House of Orphans. Now, this doesn't look very good. It's supposed to be a Swedish horror film, and from what I've seen of it, it looks a little bit cheap. So, you know, this might be one that doesn't really impress me, but I'm really thankful to get the opportunity to actually see it. Next up, we have Morgan Paulson. Now, this is supposed to be sort of like a, a reporter film. It's supposed to be a comedy. Uh, this is a Swedish movie, I believe, or, yes, yeah, Swedish, or it could be Danish. No, Swedish. So, yeah, as I said, no idea what this is like. So, uh, yeah, uh, it's a blind sort of experience, which I am really psyched uh, to find out what it's like. Next one is On Tro, which is another Swedish film, I believe. Uh, this, I uh, once again have no idea what it's going to be about. It's supposed to be very psychological, so I'm really looking forward to it. Next one we have is Summer Scars. Now, this is a UK horror film. I've seen this being released here in Australia. Really didn't uh, want to buy it, but thankfully it has been sent to me, so I'm not really risking anything by watching it. But it, it looks fairly interesting, so yeah, I'll be letting you guys know what I think of it. Next one is Blaman. This is a, a Danish comedy, I believe. Uh, yeah, uh, once again, you know, as is the case with most of these films, I've got no idea what to expect. So I'm in for an exciting time, I'm sure. Uh, next one is Isolarad. I believe it's maybe isolated, transla uh, translated into English. Stars Peter Stormare. So this looks very psychological, and I really like my psychological horror films. So I'm looking forward to that one. And we've got two more left. We have Soulstorm, which, once again, no idea, sorry. So you're going to have to wait till the review to see what I actually think of it. So um, it looks interesting. And I can't really uh, read in the Scandinavian or Swedish language, so the synopsis on the back is giving me no indication. And then last but not least, this is a Russian film, I believe, called The Cuckoo. And this is supposed to be a beautiful film, uh, set during the World War. And, yeah, I mean, this promises to be something uh, different, so I'm looking forward to that one. All right, guys, that's it for this update. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, as I said, please feel free to subscribe to Magnus. He's a great guy. And, um, yeah, show him some support because more people like him deserve to be encouraged on YouTube. So that's it, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Till next time, keep watching movies, and I'll see you later. Bye.